Hey, good morning Martians, how's it going? Today I'm spending some time in the Enforce Workbench checking out all the objects in the game. And there's a ton in here that have been, uh, not been implemented yet. But uh, I just thought I would uh, share this with you guys in case you guys haven't uh, been able to uh, launch the Workbench to check out some stuff. So I was just clicking around and I know that some of this stuff can only be spawned in, like certain characters. This one says Droid. Um, so I'm not really sure what the droid is. Not many parts of that. And it looks like it's been destroyed. So maybe that's what it means. Destroyed something. Um, so I was just uh, checking out some stuff. And if some of these are blank, I'm not really sure how they fit in. Um, they got the, like, the office guy. You can spawn some of these guys in. Uh, but you can't. I mean... You know, if you're making a scenario, if you want some dead bodies laying around, I guess. And a scientist. Some other components. But here's some tools. And there's a few not in the game yet. You know, we only have, um... What is it? We got the, the medical tricorder thing. This thing here. And... And the construction tool, but it seems to have soil auger piece, which goes, I guess, with this. Like if you're going to take a soil sample. It's pretty interesting stuff. Um, let's see. Let's see what else I found in here earlier. It looks like, <coughs> you know, a lot of the furniture's in there. So I was trying to take a peek to see what might be coming in later. Got the beds. Oh wait a minute, I wonder why they're in the ground like that. That's kind of interesting. I'm trying to figure out, I'm not real uh, keen on all this. Oh, okay, I can turn the ground off. There we go. Some of them are below the grid. Let me turn the grid off. There we go. Now we can take a look. A little cleaner way of looking at it. And water station. So a lot of this stuff is in there. And I think these are probably test objects. Oh, that's pretty cool. And the screen. A little bit of moraine going on. A lot of asteroids. Um, let's see here. Yeah, we got a lot of asteroids in there. That's pretty cool. I think the beagle is some kind of a probe. And buttons. So it looks like we're going to get some buttons. Maybe possibly light switches. Oh, that's like a comm. Go on next to your doors or something. That'd be cool. Yeah, we need buttons, man. That's for sure. Hope. Oh, wait. These are probably buttons that are on the, the hauler. I'm not mistaken, these are probably already used. Yeah, these are hauler buttons, I believe. One of these was, uh, yeah, that's what that is. But we need to have these so we can magnetically stick them onto uh, door panels. Oh, wow, these are. Oh, yeah, that's a, that's a nice uh, connectors here, cables. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like it. See now, why we would have a cannonball? I'm not really sure, but it's got a Martian three-eyed smiley face on it, so there you go. And that doesn't have anything. Container and destroyed container. That's the door.
Wow, these look pretty cool. Especially if they open. Let's cruise on down here. Oh, they even got craters you could put in. Nice. Debris for some of the scenarios. Like a crash site. Uh, ooh. Wow. That's pretty cool. A little bit of environment going on. Wow. Even custom dunes. And I've seen these floating around a bit where you go out and like you take a I think I jumped one in a vehicle once and crashed and killed myself. So we got rocks, ice caps. I guess that's for the poles. Interior add ons. So some of these things you can spawn in right now. I have no need for them and with my problems with too many objects um, glitching out my uh, textures I can't really use a lot of these. Is that a file folder? Yep, folders. So that's nice that we have like little decorations and too bad you can't use the refrigerator. I spawned one of these in just to see if we could uh, put stuff in it but nope. So a lot of these things are just for looks for now. Ooh. Hmm. Ladders, lights, uh, developers, possibly. What the hell is that? What is that, like a car wash component? Kind of has that wand, looks like a car wash. Maybe a de-duster? It says pressure cleaner. Yeah, I don't know why I just didn't read it. I'm so used to uh, seeing non-descriptive names in game. Uh, receiver, screwdriver, shelves. So little uh, things you can place around the area. Oh yeah, see that'd be nice decorations for like in the shop. Oxygen, radio, repair kit. Let's see, anything else? Let's go to uh, outdoor testing, projectiles. Okay, we got a bullet. <laughs> there you go. Game over. Got that little satellite in the opening of the game that's cruising around the planet. Uh, that's the monolith. Got more stones. Some oh, a thruster. Oh. And then we got the highlights. Let's go down here. We got monitors. Oh, displays for different monitors, like for the elevators and doors. Nothing on the signs. We got plants. Potato plants. We got trees. You know, I have a couple of these that I spawned in I can't get rid of. 
It was like a bush. And it, nothing to grab to delete it. It's really driving me nuts. That might be what's causing my glitches. Yeah, it's like this one here. It's over there where I want to build the greenhouse. And I can't delete them because there's no uh, select point on it. I've tried for like an hour. So that drove me nuts. Still is. I've got ragdoll characters, seeds. Planets. Wow. Some of the food products. I'm going to get down to the structures. Okay, we've got beds. Okay, that's the top. Oh, I don't, okay, I don't remember seeing that one implemented yet. Okay, we possibly have that one. Or that one. Some are grungier than the others. That's pretty cool. And, oh, I do remember seeing some of these broke-ass bastards. Ooh, console. Wonder where that's at. Oh wow, that would be cool if you could, these displays actually displayed stuff. You got your light beacon, light tripod. Now we have these big antennas you can spawn in. They have no use, obviously. Well, none of them do at this point. There's that thing you can slap on those antennas. Let's see, we got more control rooms. Ooh. Oh, the control room. That's where you, when you do a mission. So that's in there. I have seen that when you do missions. Decontamination chamber? Possibly. Oh, it says right there. Decontamination. Ooh, hangar. I saw some stuff under building comp Okay, are we getting closer? Okay, we got lab stuff. Okay, here's some more cap power cable. Okay, there it is. There's that box. The hub we all needed. And see, I hadn't looked in here to check everything, so I don't know if these were in here before they were actually implemented. So I thought I would take a look. We got the 3D printer. And then it has arm collision. So it looks like those arms will collide with you at some point. That would be wicked. That would mean they would have to fix that display panel right here. Airlock suit hanger. Comms array. Now, when they have in game communications, we'll need to have this near each area, and who knows what kind of range it would have. Um, so, you'd probably have to have a repeater and stuff. That would be pretty cool. And if it was down and not enough power, you couldn't communicate. That'd be awesome. Standard door, internal, external. Now here's some doors that we don't have yet. I saw them on the prefabs, a couple, something like this. But yeah, if we could use some of these internal doors, that'd be great. I've seen that one, that one. Uh, I don't think we've seen this one. No, we haven't. And what is this doorway panel? Doorway airlock. Yeah, 
Yeah, and see, I've seen some of these on the prefabs, but we don't have access to them yet. These actually have the little tips on them, unlike the prefabs, so it looks like they could snap in. Oh, that's... Does that say floor? Exterior... Something? Extra filler? So it looks like, you know, some of this we're using. Floor large. Oh, what's that? Rail slot. Floor rail slot probably just so they don't snap on like they do now underneath kinda oh but this is inside so if you have like a upstairs maybe overlooking whoa okay what's what the hell is this life support oh my god that's awesome it looks similar to what's on the door, actually. We, let's see, where was that doorway? Yeah, right there. That part here. Doesn't that kind of look like uh, a little bit of life support thing going on? But that's a nice little panel. I like it. That should be coming up pretty much soon I'm thinking lift base ooh elevators nice oh wow yeah yeah that's what I'm talking about it probably runs oh rail lift rail oh okay so I see it ch it goes up this uh, little teeth and Go up the railing there. Some of this we have already. Platform pieces. Now this guy still doesn't snap onto anything too bad. Kind of handy to have that working. Refinery, refinery gooey. Got these. Maybe not all of them though. Like we don't definitely don't have this one. Ooh, well that's weird. It kind of goes into a round piece. Huh. How would that fit onto something? There must be another piece with a round cutout on it. I noticed the other day this thing actually vacuums around. That was pretty cool. Automatic light. I was hoping to run across some... Uh, Newer components, and there were a few. So we got the new power junction. Or outlets, I mean. Vertical groove. Is that so you... Oh, I see. I bet you you'll be able to snap another wall component right off of a wall. To make walls that's that's cool because these pins line up with these holes oh yeah yeah that that's I need that and not just on this component uh, I need that on the new stuff the new habitat I guess or uh, is that the base one of them's a habitat one of them is a base I'm not sure the windows And we have Mars Base Final. So we have that without a hang in it, a suit hanger in it. That 
it must be interior uh, we don't have this door it's got to be a inside airlock door I guess uh oh texture problems see that's what I'm talking about uh, sorry for the pauses there I have to sneeze and cough at times I'm off sick today so I thought I'd spend some time in looking through here yeah some more of these weird components the curved pieces intrigue me I gotta keep checking both sides see this has a outdoor on both sides that's unusual I believe yeah yeah these are all yeah there's the normal inside oops ah if that's the normal inside is this the outside but that's like a, a walking part weird I mean it's called floor extra filler floor okay let's see if I see that I'm gonna skip down a little bit okay oh we got floor second fl we got a second floor floor second floor it's called that's kind of weird interior door see now th these this is cool we need to get these I know they're working on it I don't want to be a bastard about it and oh this one's got two rails on it for a lift yeah man I can't wait although since I'm limited to the size I could build and components I can use not sure how high I can go with the building but that may help with construct wow look at that what the hell what the hell is that it's called printer back oh printer base printer base so we're gonna have to put a base down and then what mount the printer to this it looks like you can put a walkway right up to it or something this is weird and printer wall printer wall maybe we got oh you know what I bet you we're gonna have to have a print facility and have it closed in printer wall filler yeah I bet you we're gonna have to because obviously you don't just have your printer sitting outside in a dust filled environment so it looks like they're gonna make us enclose it and then this if it says back it, I bet you that's where you put your um hell I don't know I mean it doesn't look like you could put a, a canister in there maybe you do slap canisters of silicates in there silicons or whatever you call it yeah oh my god that's gonna be awesome okay let's see ramp again so it's in there a few times okay we got the steps wall ceiling it's like they're repeating here wall window yeah so let's see now we're back into the repeats again okay now these don't have the pins on them so this must be what's used for the prefabs because they're just put together and you can't use them you can't take them apart you skip over those modular base this here we go that's what I'm talking about now now we can get us a close look at these parts so it would seem these are behind the scene parts because there's no tech you know the blue bathroom tile texture there it is okay so this would be a part that bulges outward airlock high airlock low and I'm using both of these right now I was able to get both those to work airlock high back airlock high back in interesting 
a little shorter or something. Yeah, and that's the low. So they're a little different. One has an N. Maybe that means a new? I don't know. Yeah, I haven't figured out how to utilize all these. I just couldn't... Um, I'm good at though. Figure out how to uh, elaborate on my constructions. Oh, that's so you don't have sharp corners. It, you could go right up the wall. It's even called corner, I believe. Corner piece. Type 1. Type 2. Okay, that way you have flat corners. That's that's awesome. And flat corners, and a, you can put a floor in. And it's a mid-floor because it's got the tile on both sides. That's pretty cool. Another corner piece. I wonder if we have corner pieces. I, I I don't remember seeing them. I'm going to have to take a closer look. I don't think we do. Or maybe I didn't know what the hell it was. What the hell is that? Oh, that would be a lower floor looking up. Oh, yeah, that's your top corner. Okay. Door. Door frame. Now it says drill base. Drill base. Well, we don't have any large drills as far as I know. Okay, I recognize those. Greenhouse glass. Let's see what else we got in here. That piece. Interior doorway. I wasn't able to get these to... I'm not sure how to use the internal stuff. We don't have this piece. So you almost need to have something like this to even start your interior um, builds. As far as adding rooms. Yeah, I like, man, this is... I can't wait. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. I don't think I can get it all done in a half hour. I'm trying to get a peek at these. Okay, we got wall and floor. Corner pieces. We don't have those for sure. Got those. Or those. Yeah, once these all start coming in, that'll be awesome. As far as um, splitting up your large building into rooms. It's like a ceiling panel. Wow. A lot of stuff in here. So yeah, right off the bat, it looks like the walls are going to be a solid color as opposed to everything having that tile. Ooh. That's kind of got a new kind of floor tile. I like it. I like that better than that blue. It says uh, interior, exterior, link two. Or maybe that was multiple walls. I'm not sure. So, what is that? Wall, floor? Not sure. Yeah, it looks like there's going to be a whole bunch more, uh, oh, a solid, what is that, a wood floor? Yeah, okay, so at least we have something to look forward to here. More interior components. Whoa, that's kind of low res there, isn't it? Yeah. 
Either I need to reboot or something's weird going on here. Could be the settings I have in here. It's something that looks kind of like wood grain. Uh, or either or the textures are jacking up on me again. It's like I got soft lighting or something going on. Let's turn that off. I don't know if that helps or hurts. Oops. Better watch out, I don't want to crash. I want to get through these. Pretty cool stuff though, I must say. I must have inadvertently change the pivot point or something when I was clicking around either that or these just have a different pivot point it's a light panel and it's new I like it and I'm glad I did that part one railing yeah I must have changed the pivot point or something on when I was clicking around like an idiot God damn it. Okay, we got some more stairs. Okay, we do have that. And it mounts to that. And I have no idea what's up with that. So, those are just three odd parts that are just slapped in there for no particular reason. We recognize these. That's a new one. Slot. Test three-sided. Yeah, I must be getting down into the weird area here. tunnel airlock see now this is what I'm talking about it's, they come with doors this is pretty cool and I don't know how the hell I messed up on the whole pivot point but oops so the doors will, oh wow it's going to be a double door we got a connector ok now we got the four way the slope and the other components Okay, we got some of these. T junction turns, walkways, and weird lighting or something going on there. Or it's reflective. Maybe it's with a plastic or glass on it. Not sure. Oh, at least we got catwalks, man. Awesome. Or at least walkways. What does that look like on the bottom? Yeah, that's outdoor for sure. I don't think you can put a walkway inside right now. Wow. And there's that one little connector thing. Okay, we've got the pallets. Probably won't be able to get through all this. Eh, the tent. Then they have those sci-fi things going on. These buildings you can't use. You, you, I think you can spawn some of these in under the sci-fi. I mean, you can't use them, though. But they look cool as hell, don't they? I mean, look at that. Yeah, that's pretty cool, man. You have to admit. That is pretty damn cool. Jeez. Man, if all this worked, that'd be freaking phenomenal. But and you know, if they snap together properly. I mean, like you know, if you uh, in if you're in the editor and you place these, they don't like snap in the right place. Yeah, I 
another one. Okay. Anyway, that's all I'm going to go through today. I just thought I'd point that out. A lot of people, you know, we're talking about other parts coming up. And this is used when you're uh, going online. Anyway, if I see anything awesome in here, I'll bring it up on my next uh, video. So I don't f sound all enthusiastic today. I'm pretty uh, under the weather. But, so I was just killing some time checking out this stuff. Wow. And thought I would just kind of go through it. Might as well record it. That way, you know, it's out there if you're interested. And remember, right click. Hold on. If you right click on Take on Mars in Steam. And then go down to the launcher, I believe it's called. And then a little window comes up. Just click on uh, the Enforce Tool Bench and work your way to the Object Viewer. If you want to check, go through here and check out some stuff. I don't think you can like mess up the game, but you know, you never know. <laughs> so I just wanted to view them. I didn't want to mess with anything, and definitely don't save. So anyway, I'll, I'll catch you guys next time.